Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Now we're working on a 2023 brand new Cadillac Escalade Platinum. These things are on back order of the dealership, so we actually got our very own. This is how we get new things, you know, right here. This is it. But hey, very high dollar, very expensive, but I think we got it for a great deal, right? Got her off the trailer and... Yeah, drove off the trailer, surprisingly, because it wasn't a run and drive. That's, a, that's great news already. Honestly, it's already a win, so I think it's a good deal. Well, let's show you guys how much we got it for. Bam, just like that, we got it. Honestly, we've been playing a couple here and there, and they're going so expensive, so I think this is a good deal. Let's go ahead and check it out, go around, see the bad, see the good. We already see the bad, but they're still good. These things are amazing, so let's go around, see if some are good. So obviously you've seen the bad side, but let's look at the good parts. I mean, start with the fender, maybe a couple little dents here and there, but. So it's got, you know, with the hood hinge hit it. Yeah, so, yeah. But that's fixable. Buckle a little bit here, but overall, all four tires, gap air pressure, driving it off the trailer is a big deal. But so, Michael, did you see that it's uh, actually sitting really low? It's got air suspension. Yeah, it must be, look at that. That wheel so, gap, it's like. Hopefully we don't have air suspension problems. You never know without a lot going on. Mirror seems good. This is probably like what a thousand dollars right here. Probably more. You just clip the back. It's got a camera on the side. Pretty sweet. Yeah, 2023 cameras, LED lights. It's already got tinted windows. Mm. Nice for sure. But look, this side's looking good. It's got a good door and back door. So hopefully we don't have to paint anything. Hey, careful, buddy. It's got careful, the chrome buddy. package. Look at, that. look at our buddy right there with your hand. Oh. oh. South Carolina, we like our banana spiders. They're actually that's, that's huge. Put your hand next to it. Let's see how big that is. I don't really want to put my hand. Doesn't look that big in the camera. Look at that. That thing is huge. But anyway, so this quarter panel is looking good. <laughs> yeah, pretty crazy. The chrome package, pretty cool. I like it. Maybe I don't know. We'll see what we do with that. But looking this side's nice. looking good. Does it look like it has a dent on, on the gas lid? Yeah, that's got a little dent right there. Yeah, that might stay there. I'm just kidding. We'll see. PDR or dentless yeah. removal. But That's the back looks pretty good. It's got a family of uh, Mickey Mouse's. So it's got mom, dad, and three kids. I don't know if that's a pet or not. Hard to tell. But Brand uh, new, and the stickers already faded or they took them off. It's pretty sweet. This thing definitely needs a wash, Michael. Maybe we can wash this thing. You could toast that, probably. Should come off, yeah. Got rear parking sensors, cameras. One, two, how many cameras? Two, three. Well, it probably has 360 and backup cameras. Yeah. 600, so what is that? Like the. I think 600 horsepower. You think so? I don't know. Jeez. But this side's are looking good. The roof yeah. is good. The back is good. You know, very sporty. Very nice. So not that much damage to mess with. No quarter panel we got to replace. Stuff like That's that. That's nice. Even though we were looking for one with quarter panel damage. But. You know, but front end, it had to be. And for this price, I think we're good. I mean, 2023, yeah. not so bad expensive. at all. All right, just like that, we could talk about the damage because the rest of it's looking pretty good and it just needs a couple front end parts. So the door did not take that much damage, which nice. is really good. Yeah. And this is how we got it. So they already took it apart and maybe we can just get away with like polishing the door, maybe just painting the fender, a hood. It's black. Black does match really good. But on this one, it does look like we have a little bit of frame damage. So this frame horn got a little, little I don't know, a fold right here in the bottom. And then rebar. So the rebar we can replace, not a big deal, but the frame horn, I don't know if we can order these or we have to replace the whole frame, so. That's really loud. So on these on the frame, so hopefully we don't have to replace the whole frame because that would be a lot of work, which we don't want to do. But if we have to, we have to. But hopefully it didn't like dime in the frame, nothing like that. The wheel is looking like it's sitting pretty good, but it looks like it's rubbing on the radio support. And on these radio supports, it's actually the whole thing. So I don't, I think it'd be easier to replace the whole thing. Like just right, like the Right, that's Silverado. all accordioned and ripped and. So radio condensers, we need 100%. Maybe a, bunch a few of brackets. Blocks. We need a bunch of computers. But it looks like right here, it actually separated. So maybe it didn't damage the firewall, it just kind of ripped it apart. Hopefully. 
which gives us a lot less work, you know, so we don't have to mess with the fire roll. Hopefully we can just like pull this thing out, get the new Radiator Sport. Hopefully getting parts is not gonna be that bad. But before we actually, you know, start working on it, I think we should give it a nice wash and see how nice this thing looks. Oh yeah. And uh, then we'll maybe like want to work on it more. Check and out the inside though, I don't really want to see what's going on in there. It looks like airbag. Inside we'll do it later. Let's give it a quick wash and go from there. Wow, definitely looking great. I mean, give it a little wash and it transforms it for sure. Now it's like you want to work on it because it's so nice. Just a little bit of work right there, but overall, beautiful. The paint's really nice. I mean, it should be 2023, pretty brand new. So hopefully it's nice being such a high dollar car, but it, yeah, I like it. But let's go ahead and get the parts, Ivan. I mean, might well, as well. Pretty much when we won it, we went ahead and ordered the parts that we definitely not, you know, we saw that we needed and uh, the dealer had them in stock. We picked them up, they're inside the shop, let's check them out. A whole bunch of parts, like Christmas. Let's check it out. All right guys, definitely a lot of parts in here. Let's talk about the big pieces first. I mean, check out this front support. Wow, it's huge. We still have our frame rails on the bottom we're gonna try to fix, but overall this, this is the most of it right there, right? So we get it kind of close. Yeah, so I mean, instead of like splicing it together, we're just gonna do the whole thing. Hopefully it's not gonna be hard to do on the back, but who knows? Who knows? We'll figure it out. But over here we got the hood itself already painted black the same color so that's nice very light surprisingly for such a massive hood but I mean, it is aluminum and then we got bump. hood hinges too yep and what's check next michael check out this bumper i mean you put these pieces together it looks like you got a front end already but we're missing the fender or do we have a fender yeah hopefully we've got a fender but for this sure bumper is. man for sure so this is off the ctsv bumper nice i mean original original color i'm gonna paint it and take it apart because that that's a lot of work right there but then guys, check it out with all the sensors, all the computers, LED lights. It is missing the radar though. Inside of here? And the camera, which we have off our other one. Yeah. So that's good. The other one's good. But this bumper is different, so hopefully it's going to fit. We're not going to need anything extra. But it comes with a water harness because we need that. A lot of parts, but not too bad. Oh yeah. So little camera right there. That's the... <sighs> Night vision sensor, I think, or something. Yeah. So that's pretty crazy. Definitely adds up all the brackets and pieces that you need, but hey, you have to have them. And being so new, I mean, you just gotta go from GM basically to red, OEM, brand new from the dealer. It is what it is, but so many pieces, brackets for the headlight, trader support. Man, check this box out. It's definitely a shopping list. Sheesh. Put brackets right there, hinges right. Yep, so we should have right and left. We should have a radiator support. We should have a lot of parts. A fender, a rebar, airbags, a lot of parts. All we have to do is start working on this thing. Yeah, so it's exciting. It's really nice when all the parts are here. Then you can start going to the project because it's pretty bad when you get out. You're like, yeah, and then you got to wait a week or two because it's back order, you know, lead time, blah, blah, blah. So it's nice. Hopefully we have everything. Not missing anything. All right, guys. So we have the car. We have the damage. We have all the parts and we're moving forward. But luckily, we actually got some help too. So check out 23rd Garage came by. 
We're gonna tag team this together, gonna collab and get this thing knocked out in no time, right? We did the Tesla together, that worked out beautifully. Oh yeah, really nice. that was fun. So we, we got, got Yuri and Nate oh, yeah. from 23rd Garage. And they're gonna, oh, yeah, yeah, they're, they're gonna help us out. For sure, this we've done in no time. So this is it, huh? This is it, what do you guys think? I mean, is it possible, is it fixable? Mm -hmm. Get this thing back in the road? I don't know, man, might need to just pull it out and put it back on the auction. <laughs> Oh man. Another come scam? On. Come no, on, you can't do that. Uh, no, dude, it's not really that bad, especially since you guys have the entire piece, right? You've right. got the entire core support. Yep. So, you know, just a matter of pulling that out and straightening this rail a bit. Yeah, that one's gonna be a little tricky, but... A lot of so you think you can't save the rail, or what are we thinking? I think that we can probably save it. I mean, worst case scenario, I'm sure you can get another one, right? Yeah, like, just the one. end, just the horn. Uh, but yeah. it looks it looks like it's, it, it may come out. I mean, it is turned up a little bit and we might have to put some heat to it, but we'll see what happens once we start pulling on it. But it's not, it's really not that bad. It's good that it's concentrated in the front. It's not like back yeah, there. Like the gaps are all bad and everything like yeah. that. The dining or something. So nice, for sure. I mean, definitely a lot of work ahead of us, but hey, like I said we're not alone. We'll get it done together. But unfortunately, that's all the time for today. Make sure you guys check out 23rd Garage. Like I said, they're gonna get this frame knocked out and hopefully get this thing looking like a car again. Not so scary in the front, but yeah, we'll get it done. But leave some comments down below, guys, if you think it's a good buy, bad buy. If you ever get one of these, I mean, definitely a lot of money, but looking good at the end. Hit that like button, we'll catch you next time.